Hello everybody, what's going on? My name is of course John Plays and welcome back to another video. It has been a while since we have made a video, but it has been a while since I have been having free time. Uh, but guys, we are back with another one. Uh, we normally on Thursdays stream uh, free game Thursdays or free random game Thursdays, but instead today I'm going to do a video. Obviously this video might be out tomorrow, which will be Friday. Uh, but you guys will end up seeing this, uh, just for people that want to check out free random games and they want to see some gameplay on it. Now, today we're going to be trying out Heroes of Aldemore. If you guys are interested in, uh, trying this game, it will be in the link in the description below. So feel free to check that out, everyone. All right, everybody, here we are in Heroes of Aldemore. I don't know anything about this game. But we're gonna go ahead and host it this time, and remember guys, this is a free game. So I really don't know what to expect. Right now, where my camera is, we have zero gold. We have our health bar. We're level one. And let's see what we can do. Is there a map? There is a map. Can I attack anything? Can we, can we jump? We can jump. By the way, this is made by one person. Ooh, what are you? Hello? Can we talk? Hello? Can we talk? Alright, let's check this building over here. Hopefully this isn't copyrighted. We are in some kind of place. Why does it sound like someone's attacking outside? Anybody out here? Sounds like somebody was getting attacked. Let's let's head outside. I don't even know what we're supposed to do. It's kind of a really beautiful world, but I'm, I don't know if we're supposed to be out here. All right, so in the instructions, when you spawn into the world, you are a lowly peasant. Soldiers from either faction will leave you alone, but you ban but bandits, but bandits will still attack you. If you want to earn some coin, try hunting in the woods. The village butcher will the the the, the village butcher will buy any meat you bring him. Buy some potions and join one of the factions. Faction recruiters can be outside can be found outside the keep of the castle for both factions. Potions are for sale outside the churches and the castles. Once you're listed in an army, you can hire soldiers to your command, bring them with you to take over the watchtowers and eventually the enemy castle. To take over location, all enemy soldiers must be defeated after the battle. Walk up to the abandoned sign and interact with it. It will turn your fat it will turn your faction's flag. You can then interact with it again to add more soldiers. When you and your soldiers have grown weary, visit the tavern to heal with some rad tunes, which we've seen. Disclaimer this game is one work in progress. For now, it is only uh, mildly entertaining and serves as proofs of my skills in the Unreal, which is true because this is made in an Unreal Engine. Now, it said that we gotta go out and hunt and get some gold, so I will try to find us an enemy to fight. Here we go, here we go, we got level one coming at us, come on! Woo! Oh jeez, there's like a horde of them! Alright, let's run! All right, no, 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 no. That was some good music. One thing I'll say about the game though, very, very good music. It looks really good for an Unreal Engine game. And I don't remember if we came in this way. Yeah, I think we did. Well, we're gonna go back uh, to the tavern, get held up and we'll continue uh, getting some more levels. Found the healing place. Alright, before we continue, um, you guys are probably wondering how I'm level 17. I was trying to learn a little bit of the game uh, off um, camera. They, I don't know if this was 
part of the game or intentionally by him, but he has some of the commands activated in the game. So if you press U on your keyboard, you're gonna notice that I'm gonna level up a thousand times fast. Uh, that's a cheat. Also, if you press Y, you can also be cheat invincible. And I don't know if he was intentionally planning on having that in there. Like, I don't know if he intentionally knew that was in there or he didn't know. Uh, so if you're watching this, I don't know if that was what you were intentionally planning to do. Um, but yeah, we're level 27 just to show him. Um, but yeah, let's, let's see what else there is. The next question I have for the developer, if they could comment this, how do we interact with the NPCs? Because they do say potions for sale, but it wasn't explained in the instructions on how to interact. Cause enter don't work. E don't work. Space don't work. Um, yeah, that don't work either. Also, the same thing with the guy that wants to buy me. I'm not sure if we can interact, so I'm not sure if I'm... I'm a little bit higher now, buddy. Wait, did I... Owner is what? I have no idea what's going on. I have no idea. Oh, but anyways, guys, I'm gonna wrap up that video. Heroes of Eldamore, if you wanna check it out, it'll be in the link in the description below. It's an interesting game. I personally think it needs a lot of fixing to do. It is in probably early access, or you know, maybe alpha or beta. It's got a lot of fixing to do. Personally, I might return to the game when it has a little bit more updates and fixes. And at least you can do something by talking to the U NPCs or at least sell your meat. Like I have three meat, uh, but I don't know how to sell it because it's not in the instructions here. It just says if you want to earn some coins, try hunting in the woods. The village butchers will buy any meat. You bring him, uh, join factions. And I don't even know how to join factions and everything like that. Uh, but to even not sell like meat or have a, a interaction to sell meat and maybe i'm mistaken and if, if i am developer please let me know uh if it's the case i will make another video on this game and we'll try tackling it again but for this game uh i'm gonna give it a probably out of three out of ten doesn't mean i hate the game that's just my overall rating uh it does need a lot of fixes but yeah no hate towards it, just a 3 out of 10, and uh, yeah, it has a lot of fixes to do. But other than that, guys, that's all I got for this video. I'm so sorry it was short. I will work on bringing out some more videos uh, next Thursday. I'll probably start doing this every Thursday, guys, where we check out the different kind of games for free on Steam. Could be bad, good, or decent games, depending if you guys have any free games that you want me to play or check out. Please let, please put them in the comments down below. Other than that, if you're new to the channel, subscribe, like, and comment. And I will see you all next Thursday. Take care, everyone.